This must be what they mean when someone says an athlete can really fly. Emma Garral is the defending state champion in the 100-yard butterfly. She's confident in her skills, but she still gets a few butterflies right before the starting gun. I get a little nervous, and um, I don't know, I just try to block everything out and concentrate on what I'm doing. Know that I've done everything up to that point that I could have done to be prepared. Emma recently set the school record in the butterfly and holds the state's fastest time in the event this season. Usually you get swimmers that will do everything else, but they can stand doing the butterfly. You know, butterflies off limits, but Emma's always like, can we do a 500 butterfly? <laughs> can we do a 1,000 butterfly just for fun? That work ethic carries over to the classroom where Emma gets excellent grades. Like her teammates, Garral has to balance schoolwork with cool work. Having to like go to practice, go home, do homework, and then get up in the morning again for morning practice and school, and it, it gets tough, but that's what weekends are for, to sleep. Now, if you know anything at all about Arrowhead swimming, you know that Emma Garral is not the only standout in this pool. Emma may be a quiet leader, but she's a quiet leader on a team that's making a lot of noise in the state. Arrowhead has enjoyed this season's results, having won every meet they've competed in, with the exception of one Invitational, in which they were narrowly beaten out by Madison Memorial. Like Emma Garral, freshman Haley Patilla is another youngster who is also a speedster. These Warhawks are a young team, but they're not at all surprised by their success. I expected our team to be doing pretty well. I mean, we had, we've got a lot of freshmen that came in that are real good. These girls are well aware of the proud history of Arrowhead swimming and the tradition they want to continue. They, they won the state title five years in a row, and then last year it kind of, we got fifth, but um, hopefully we can get back into that rhythm, get back into winning state titles again. With that goal in mind, the team held a 24-hour relay event to kick off what they hope is another championship season and to remember former Arrowhead swimmer Stacy Mayer, who died in a car accident last year. In order to tie her memory in with what our goal is at the end of the season, we brought that up with them right away. And our fundraiser, we swam 58.1 miles, which is over 100,000 yards. We wanted to do something to bring the team together, um, come up with a way to remember Stacy, and do something that the state would notice to let everyone know that Arrowhead's back and we're ready to go. Arrowhead will compete in the Classic A Conference meet this coming weekend. After that, it's sectionals and then state. Here's Jessica Anderson presenting Emma Garral with our feature student athlete plaque, courtesy of Boston Store.